in my mind, there's there's kind of this multi-dimensional landscape, and depending on where you are in that landscape, sort of dictates what structure is appropriate. So some of the dimensions you've got that you can travel on is like, like you say, how big is the group? And the more people are involved, kind of the more likelihood of things being annoying. And so you're going to need some structures. You're going to anticipate what's going to be frustrating and how can we make that more efficient. But another dimension you've got is, like you said, about the leadership. How, how much trust is there? How much clarity is there in the shared purpose? How much enthusiasm? Are people really excited about being there and they'll basically just put up with anything or are they kind of reluctant participants and they're going to be nitpicking and looking for any reason to get frustrated? Like these are really important dimensions. Another one, like I mentioned earlier, is the, the time scale. Like if I'm going to be there for three days, well, we can handle it being very informal and some things are not very efficient. And it turns out that I did twice as much dishes as you did, but it's three days, who cares? But if it's a three month thing, you want to have a fair distribution of labor and you're probably going to have to put some system design in there to guarantee that. 